What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another YouTube video. Today I want to talk to you guys about my prediction for when I think the altcoins are going to experience some positive price action. They have gone up in the past couple of days slash two weeks or so since Bitcoin has kind of exploded, but it is not altcoin season yet. And if you guys haven't gotten to experience the altcoin season, let me just say buckle up because you're in for a ride. Now in honor of Bitcoin hitting $88,000, uh, my double B, which is my logo, Blockchain Bay. Uh, feel free to check it out. I got some stickers. If you guys want a sticker, let me know. I'll send it to you for free. All I need is your address. Don't worry about postage or anything. I got it all covered. But let me know if you guys want one. You can reach out to me either via email or through Discord, and I'll send you guys a sticker free of charge. So let's get into talking about the topic of today's video. So I have two tabs here. I guess first we'll go to the Bitcoin, obviously. $88,000 and almost touched it almost touched $90,000 today. Okay, that is huge and there's a lot of reasons for this probably because of Trump being elected and him being pro crypto along with a bunch of other Republican people being elected into office that are aiming to be pro crypto. I think it's very important for the space that you have politicians that are writing the legislature to be pro crypto and Trump has hinted at the possibility of a Bitcoin reserve or a crypto reserve all of this information you can't just put aside regardless of your political beliefs or affiliations i guess it's not yeah um this is real stuff that is happening so you can't just set it aside as it's not true or whatever and especially even with elon and, and x everything that has been going on has been leading us to this moment where we're at right now with bitcoin at eighty eight thousand dollars okay now none of this stuff i'm saying in this video is financial advice i want to put that as a disclaimer and this is my opinion so take that with a grain of, a grain of salt grain of rice i don't know but the point of this is to compare previous trends to what we see now so when bitcoin boomed in 2021 i can show you guys here it boomed in april all right it had a little bit of a high in april and then it went down and then went back up in around November. Now you notice in November, Bitcoin only went a little bit higher. So there was two all time highs. It hit in 2021. It went all the way up to, I think it was $69,000 at the time. Then it dipped back down and then we didn't see those numbers again until this year. And then it's been all over the place. And now we're at the price that we're at now. Now you can take this for almost any altcoin and altcoin is every coin that's not Bitcoin. Bitcoin is the main coin because it was the first coin. So if you're confused on that definition, there's a there's a uh, easy explanation for you. So if you were to look at Solana during this time, so remember this date, key date, 4-13-2021. If I go to 4-13-2021, you look at this. It's a little bump, okay? So this little bump was a massive bump on Bitcoin's chart. Massive spike, massive inflow, $77.45 billion in the 24 hour volume. You go over to Solana and Solana wasn't as well known during this time, but just a, a small 570 million. You can apply this to all of them. Look, Avalanche, Solana, Dogecoin is another example. It didn't do anything in this initial bull run, although Dogecoin actually exploded probably because of everything that was going on with you know <laughs> you guys had to be around for that but with the exception of maybe dogecoin you can look at pretty much every chart and it is the exact same time frame what happened was a few months later so if you jump forward to when bitcoin hit its second all-time high of around six i think it says it says sixty six thousand. so i'll just roll with that so just round to 67,000. You take that and you apply that on what day? That was 11, 2021, 11, 9. And that's when the all time highs started to pick up. So, what is that? A, a seven month difference, six month difference? I'm trying to do quick math. I've been doing accounting all day. So, my brain is fried. So, forgive me if my math is not right. But look at the difference it took uh, a couple months. And all of a sudden, these coins exploded. And this is where millionaires are going to be made. People talk about this all the time. And if you're getting new into crypto, this is what we were talking about. This happened in 2021 when everyone started asking about crypto and everything blew up. And I think, and this is just my prediction, I don't think this is going to happen again. Maybe one more time if we're lucky after this 
I think this is going to be the super cycle. This is a super cycle that everyone talks about just based on the fact that U.S. politicians are on board with crypto for the first time ever. They've always been about dismissing it and kind of shoving it. And there have been a couple people here and there that have been pro crypto. But you have a Republican House, a Republican Senate and a Republican Congress. And you got a Republican president who most of whom are in support of some sort of crypto reserve or just in support of crypto. Now that is just a multiplier that nobody knows how far it will trickle down, but it's going to be huge. It's going to be massive. So my prediction, if I go full screen here, my prediction, and I I don't know, I really don't know what it's going to end up being with the prices that we're going to see, but I have so many of so many tokens. I have, I'm just just I'm stretched out. I have all my eggs in a bunch of baskets. I'm spec mining. I'm mining Litecoin. I'm mining Dogecoin. All of this is in preparation for what's about to happen. And I think if you go off of past trends, we can see something. We can expect to see something within five months. Okay. I know that sounds like it's so far away, but keep in mind I said within five months. So it could be it could be next week. We could see altcoin season. I don't think that's the case. I think it's gonna. Nothing's going to actually happen until Trump gets into office. And I'm not trying to be, bring politics into this, but that's just that's just a fact. I mean, he is a pro Bitcoin, pro crypto president. At least that's what he claims. And that's going to pretty much just accelerate the crypto market and the crypto sector. So I'm really excited for this. Let me know your guys thoughts. Maybe we can have like a little friendly bet in the comment section below for what month you guys think is going to happen and whatever month wins maybe uh maybe i'll do like a little giveaway of something so let me know what you guys think do you think i'm off do you think i'm close to being right uh, i i'm open to hearing your opinions and i hope this was a cool interesting video just kind of looking at past trends to predict the future that's how everyone does it that's how the weather channel does it that's how the pollsters do it we're just guessing here no one really knows the answer if we did we'd all be millionaires but Thank you all so much for watching. And once again, if you want a Blockchain Bay sticker, feel free to reach out to me on Discord or email me and I can get one sent your way. I'll see you guys on the next video. Have a great one. Peace out.